game, play no game, play no game, play, play no game, play. This video is for HowToMarkCards.com. Then we're gonna show the brand new analyzer, the A4 Pro, with uh, capable of 5G. So the case is a light bluish color, which is a little different from the A5. Now I know A4 sounds like it's a step before A5, but the A4 Pro has more memory than the A5, so this is considered the newest, best one on the market. Now I changed the the accessories in in the um, on the website to have the uh, earbud as optional because the phones are now Bluetooth unlocked, so you can use your own earbuds. But the earbud that we offer is also um, you're able to get as an accessory, so an add-on instead of coming with it. So the new design has the 5G symbol, clear black side. The camera will be right here. Um, volume button, volume up, volume down, power button. It comes with a protector on the case. Comes with the remote. And I normally only use the remote to do player up, player down. So we won't get into that. And then I'm going to show you a couple examples on the bicycle standard cards. Now turning on the poker analyzer. You're going to want to charge on this one. Usually it comes around 10% when it comes in the mail. So Make sure to charge it before you do it. Another update I forgot to mention. It is now the USB-C charger. Instead of the older iPhone charger. So this makes it easier and faster to charge. It's a very, very quick charge. I plugged it in for about 10 minutes and it got it from 10% to 40%. So it'll come unlocked like this. To get into the analyzer, you go to the phone, go to the settings, star, one, three, six, eight, star. Still the Sacred Cow 1 program. So same program as the A5. Leave the top as admin, the bottom should be, if it's, if there's nothing in here, it should be star, one, three, six, eight, star again but I already added it, so now you can just hit enter. Now here's the same exact game modes. You got system information, common games. Oops. You have system updates, that's for updating to Bluetooth or adding a fourth game. Um, adding games costs, so you have three games total to add. Because they're all in trial mode until you add a game. After three games, then any additional game um, will be can be unlocked for fifty dollars. And in here, game hall, we have these three games or all these games. So each list, like flush game, there's a list of games. Texas Hold'em, there's a list of games. Read card directly. This is for magicians. Direct newspaper. This is a pretty good game for magicians. It's um, you can read cards directly, top to bottom. And this is the basic outlining of the poker analyzer. Now we're going to show you the time clock mode for read card only or read card directly. So let me open up the bicycle. So, Queen of Hearts, Jack of Hearts, Six of Spades. Let's remember those three. We're going to go to Direct Newspaper, Top 1, Test. We want to count up to, let's say, 10 cards. We can go up to 30, play 30 cards. They call them players, but 30 cards. We're going to do 10 
just for an example on this one. And then deal top to bottom. That's so it's top to bottom. If you were flipping the phone like this and reading the cards, then you'd want to do bottom to top. So note that. Uh, we're going to do voice so then you can hear it. There's also a vibrator function and there's a voice and vibrator. The vibrator is an extra accessory. It connects to the phone via Bluetooth and it gives you the winning hand by vibration. So seat two would be two vibrates. Speaker versus headset. Speaker's on the phone so we can hear it right now. Headset is the earbud, if you buy the earbud, or your personal Bluetooth. Voice mode, so then video selection, the local camera. If you had an accessory, like the poker anal or the um, power bank camera, you would change this to wireless 2.57G. Deck of cards, you can have two decks of cards if you wanted, but we're doing one. Now we're gonna do 10 players, play. Now, right now, you're not in time clock. This is just aiming, and it's giving you the result. Card, queen, card, jack, space, six, space, five, As you can five, see, card, two, card, five, diamond, seven, it gives you jack, the space, color, seven, card, queen, queen, heart, card, jack, jack, heart, space, six, space, five, club, and five, six of spades. Two, card, five, this is the diamond, top three. Seven, club, jack, now, if you want seven, time clock mode, you go jack, into here, six, six, hit time space, clock five, mode, club, five, now it turns into card, a clock. Five, if you look careful, you can see the cards. And again, top, jack, and six. This does it say. This next part is programming the analyzer. So, let's say we're doing Texas Hold'em, um, five card poker, Texas Hold'em style, where you get two cards, five community. We're going to do three player, just to do an example real quick. We're going to do deal card settings. Now, if you're looking at this, you have to go into deal card settings. And you have to change this, because right now, you're getting the first, everybody is receiving seven cards. And the best five cards in your hand wins. So to change this ruling, see, there's three columns here. Deal, open, remove. Deal means in your hand, open means community cards, remove means the burn cards. So if you're thinking about a full game of poker, how you want to set it up would be you pass out two cards each person. So the first two actions, deal, deal. The next action will be a burn card, and then they flip up three cards. So burn card, three community cards. Next set of actions, another burn card, and then the turn card. Next set of actions, a burn card, and the river card. So that's how you program the analyzer. Then hit enter, let it stay as default or name it whatever you want, hit OK. Now it's set, now it's programmed, now you go back into here and you'll see it. That's how you program the analyzer. So now it's right. Now we're going to show you how to connect it to an external camera. So let's say you bought the power bank with your analyzer. So now you have a power bank. Hopefully I have it charged, I haven't tried it yet. So first thing you need to do, change the local camera to wireless 2.57G. Now when you're about to go into the game, this is all you do. Now when you hit play, you'll see static instead of the local camera. Now you're gonna get static. I have a lot of people asking, why is it static you will? That's the number one issue, is you have to change it to local camera or add your device. So adding it for a power bank, now I have guides on all the different external cameras, but for the power bank, you hold down the power button. So let's hold down the power button. Now it should connect on the screen. Notice how it's black now and you can see the movement. So now, you got the cards here. You have the analyzer camera. Now, 
So it's saying the winning hand is winning, or seat number two out of three people. Now you can have the phone off the table, and it still recognizes. Now to deactivate the external camera, it refills. And now here's another thing that I want to mention because it just did that. If you're in test mode, if you're in test mode, it will stop. If you're not touching the screen, it'll stop and freeze and say start game. That's not a problem when you buy the game. And now when I say buy, you're not buying it. You're just downloading. You have three games when you get the analyzer. If you want more than three games, then it's 50 extra. Now, it's not freezing yet, but it will freeze on the screen and say start game. Like, I think right now it's going to. And that's because you're in test mode. So, to deactivate the power bank, you just hold it again. And it should go back to a blurry screen. Then you can go back, you can go back, you can change it to local camera, go back in, and now it's this camera again. Now we're going to test the speed and the distance of the analyzer. So first I want to test the speed, so I'm going to drop it at 10 inches, which is the minimum. That was about a one second read, so... So pretty fast. Another way of testing it is going. Move it on the top part. Oh, stop again. Hang on. Now let's see the distance. So we're at. Right here, so we're at 7 inches. Can't really read it yet. 8. So about 8 inches minimum. 15. 16. 17. Got 18. So right around the same exact amount as the other camera. Slightly better because it can go 17 and a half this is binding the earbud so we have different settings here so common settings oh, I went the wrong one common settings if you look right here set up sound so speaker headset headset type you got Report card settings continue. That's going two, 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 two instead of doing it once or twice or whatever. Now, remote control settings. This is to add your remote control. So you would flick that on, pair it when that you take the, you make sure the battery's in. You take the little plastic piece out, pull the plastic piece out, battery's in, hit that, hit pair. And just hit the up button. Then it'll find it and pair it. Pairing the earbud. This is the vibrator. Let's go to this one first. So vibrator settings. You can you get the vibrator. You have it charged. You hit the power button. You hit. Um, you can unconnect it or you can add it. Now, headset, when you hit headset, it'll ask you to bing earphone, that's bind, and unbind. So, here's the earbud. Now, earbud unscrews at the bottom, and you'll see, it's got a... You would have to put batteries in it, and then you unscrew it, 
and then you hit Bing earphone and it should connect to the nearest earphone. And then look at the, the model on here. So this is the V2, so you'd go to V2 Pro and then you'd Bing. It's got to be the right one too. And that's it for earbud. Now to unbind it, let's say you don't want it connected to it, you would just hit that unbind. Now to bind your own Bluetooth, like if you have earbuds you want to do, um, wireless earbuds, you would go out of the phone and bind it the same way you do any other phone. So there is a Bluetooth function right there. You would just connect Bluetooth via that way. And then you would leave it Let's go back into the system. You would leave it as speaker mode. Because your their speaker is binded on your Bluetooth. Now last we're gonna do a product demonstration. So I'll just put that right here. Texas Hold'em. Let's just do a regular game, three player, local camera, speaker. Now, wait, what? let's go back. I don't want just the winning hand. Let's say I want... First and second largest. Smallest to largest. Let's do the first and second. Three player. So player two wins, player one is next in line. So you got player one, player two, player three, player one, player two, player three, burn, flip three, burn, turn, burn, river. Six twos, nothing. They got nothing. Jack five has two pair of jacks and sevens. Queen five is second in line with the large card. So two, best hand, next best hand, three, or one. So two, best hand, one, second best hand. Play, play, no games. Play, play, no games. Play, play, no games.